It's time for Education Matters. Tomorrow is the new year and students are just days away from getting back to class. We're here with Dr. Craig Douglas. So let's talk about some of the New Year's resolutions for students. Hi, yes. good morning. Good morning and Happy New Year yes. to everyone. The year 2020 sounds so distant, but I it's know. just around. Tomorrow. Yeah. <laughs> So for students, I, I looked on the web and there's some great suggestions, tips, if you will, for parents in terms of talking with their students about the concept of New Year's resolutions. Mm -hmm. New Year's resolutions to me are, are different goals that people can set, some very individual, some maybe less individual. For students, uh, the obvious one might be to take a, a subject that's a particular challenge for them that first semester and as the second year approaches, making it a priority to improve in that subject. Maybe it's spelling words, maybe it's math, whatever the subject is, that's kind of an obvious one. But I thought it was a really good one for this period of time as school resumes pretty quickly next week for most, most students. Second really surprised me, and that is to consider uh, suggesting to the child, to the student, learning something brand new. Mm -hmm. Maybe it's piano lessons. Maybe it's uh, some other gymnastics, some other training that they're not really exposed to in school that would be unique and would really challenge them. Maybe it's a foreign language. There's all sorts of uh, resources on the web that are low cost or no cost. I thought that was a great idea. Um, I mean, for all of us, when we take on or tackle something brand new, and we grope with the challenges and the frustrations, but we push through it, that's a great feeling of accomplishment. What a great lesson for, for students of all ages. The third one also surprised me, and that is to consider having the child, the student, help support mom or dad in a resolution. Mm -hmm. So let's say hypothetically either mom or dad wants to say quit smoking or one of the other popular ones that you see pitched all this, uh, this time of the year all over. Having the child help support mom and dad in reaching that goal, that kind of a spirit of unity. Or maybe there's a family goal, maybe saving for a particular trip or vacation in the summer starting now. So setting goals, those are great lessons for students of all age and this is an opportunity now on New Year's Eve day mm -hmm. to maybe think about that conversation tomorrow or in the coming days with the students at home as they approach the return to school. Yeah, it's a good time of year to do that. And hey, if you're trying something new, it might be something you're great at and didn't even know. That's correct. Well, thank you so much for being here with us this morning, Dr. Douglas. Always appreciate it. Good luck to all the students out there in the new year. And if you have more or you want more information on today's topic, check out the TV5 Hotlinks page.